Yo, what is up you guys? John Brown here back with another video and today I'm going to be giving a tutorial on how to butterfly click 20 plus CPS in three simple steps. Let's get right into it. So for starters, if you want to know how to butterfly click, you need to know what butterfly clicking is. So I'm going to show you how people normally click. They go like this, just clicking once like that easy. Butterfly clicking is when you use two fingers and hit the mouse in a scissors motion, like scissors. Could you change each one changes? One's up, the other one's down, one's down, the other one's up. And it goes like this. With this, when people made it up, they're like, oh, you can get two times more CPS this way because you're clicking it two times more with two times more fingers. And that is true. But you can also click more using a strategy called double clicking. And that's what we're going to go talk about next. So now that you know what butterfly clicking is, it's time for you guys to learn the next essential step to get 20 plus CPS, and that is double clicking. Double clicking is when you click your mouse once and two clicks register. There's a unique sound, so hear it, normal click and double click. So double clicking, uh, there are a ton of strategies to do it, which I will talk about later, but the first thing you need to know is if your mouse can double click, because as time goes on, more and more modern mouses can't double click because Minecraft is the only game where you actually want to double click. Like if you're gonna click on Google Chrome to open up YouTube, you don't wanna get two Google Chrome tabs. Or if you're playing a shooter's game, you don't wanna click twice on your inventory and other stuff like that. But there are some mouses that have been specifically designed for Minecraft that can double click really well. Like my mouse, the Bloody A Bedlist, which I recommend getting. Also, you can get the Model O. So now let's hop over into Minecraft and I'll show you how to double click. So here I am on Hypixel and I'm going to show you guys how to double click. So the first thing you need to know is that not all mouses can double click as I already said. And to see if your mouse can double click, just look up can my whatever your mouse is double click. Most of the time it will not come up though. So you could just have to try it yourself. And I'm just going to show you the best ways to double click and I'd give it a day. After a day if your mouse haven't, you haven't been able to double click on your mouse once, then that probably means that your mouse can't double click. Let me show you the two best strategies. The first one's by far the best though. So you see my finger here, you see how it's like two lines. This top line, you want the top line of your finger to hit the edge of your mouse. And that's how you get two CPS. You just hold it like very straight, rigid, and just go down. See, I clicked once, didn't click twice, and I got two CPS. And that's what I'm talking about. That's double clicking. So another strategy is you curl your mouse. This one's much worse, but it's the second best strategy. All other strategies just don't even practice them, honestly. So you go like this, and there you go. Two clicks. You can also triple click and quadruple click with the same strategy, but that is unnecessary for 20 plus CPS. So before we end off the double clicking part of this tutorial, I need to talk about one more thing, and this is the double clicking strategy. So when you're playing in a game, you can also double click. So like PVP, instead of just clicking normally like this, you can just double click normally. And I feel like this is a really good way to make your fingers get stronger because a lot of people, when they butterfly click, they can, they don't, they want like strong fingers. They can't click fast and they can't click fast and also think about double clicking every single time. And that's really hard for them. So it was really hard for me too. So what I did is I practiced double clicking in game. So I just went like this and I PVP like this. So if you look at like my first video, I think that's when I was still doing using the double clicking strategy and it works. You can still win games just a bit harder. So if you want to do that, if you don't have strong fingers, want to get stronger figures and want to get better at double clicking before you start butterfly clicking, I recommend doing that. For if you don't, then let's go into step three. So the last things I'm going to talk about in this tutorial are practice and skills. So butterfly clicking is a very hard clicking method. So don't be surprised if you don't get it within the first week or first two weeks, because it is really hard. You need to think about it. You need to think about double clicking. You need to think about rhythm. You need to think about actually PVPing while you're in the game. So it's really hard. It's just like, uh, it's just like drag clicking. You need to think about it while you're doing it. But to make things easier, I'm going to give you some skills and techniques that I think are really useful. One skill you guys should develop is always try to double click before speed. So a lot of people, they should just double click really fast 
and without practice. And if you don't practice how to get those double clicks correctly in, you're going to end up just si single clicking. And that's, you don't want to do that. So I say start slow. So if you could only double click like this, but every single time you double click, you want to practice this instead of going really fast because you're barely getting any less CPS and you're actually practicing and developing good techniques. Once you master being able to double click slowly, then you can pick up the pace. And there you go. Like I'm not even trying, I can get more than 20 CPS. Another thing you guys wanna keep in mind is that just like pretty much everything in life, you're gonna come up with a problem. Like my problem was that when I butterfly clicked, I actually lifted my mouse. And I don't actually have a really good solution for those things. Like what you have to do is you just have to persevere, keep on doing it. And then over time, you will grow accustomed to it or you'll actually change it automatically. Like, I don't even know how I stopped lifting up my mouse. Just one day I was doing it and then I stopped doing it and I didn't even realize. And then suddenly I was just insane at PVP. And maybe you could have a problem similar to that. Maybe you could have a totally different problem. And basically what I'm just saying is that practice is the best way to overcome those things. So always remember that. And this is the end of the tutorial. Thank you guys so much for 350 subscribers and I'm trying to get monetized, so yeah and subscribers just get me to a thousand after that just come on come on just get me to a thousand you know you know what you have to do so thank you everybody one more time and i hope you enjoyed the tutorial